Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in. Alessandro the Crypto here. I hope you're doing all fine. Let's start with the daily TA because Bitcoin is still trapped in this potential bullish ascending triangle. I was hoping to catch the breakout today but it looks like that we're gonna see a breakout here maybe just before the weekend or during the weekend. So everyone is now waiting for the breakout of this uh, pattern and I think the breakout of this pattern will also decide the next couple of weeks where we're going to trade above 10k and maybe even towards new all-time highs or back again towards $6,000 to have a final dump before the beginning of the real bull run so you should be prepared for all scenarios guys it's really hard to trade right now I'm also not trading currently over on a buy bit with leverage so I took a little bit of profits out yet just to be sure that I can buy some cheaper bitcoins in case that we fall down and if we start to moon from here, I'm also fine with that. And most likely if I'm on the computer, I'm going to go live over on Twitch. So make sure also to join the um, a Twitch channel. Uh, you can find the link down below here in the video description for the Twitch channel and also for the Discord trading chat. There I'm also going to announce if I'm going live or if I'm trading here the breakout. So I'm waiting here for a breakout and if I'm on the computer I will go live with my trade. So I'm watching here if we can break the 10,000 to go long maybe and if we are losing here this possible 9,600 to 9,500 dollar uh, support that I will go short with the target first of around 8,000 and if 8,000 or 9,000 is not holding then I think we could go even down to 6,200 dollar this would be the worst case scenario in my opinion it's also depending what the stock market is going to do it's a bit volatile right now it's going a bit up and down so we have to see also here what's going on I think this also could a bit indicate where the next move is going to happen but we should expect here a breakout pretty soon the latest uh, on the 22nd to 24th of may i think so i guess that most likely friday or saturday we're gonna see latest here a breakout um yeah so currently nothing much has uh, changed since yesterday we're just uh uh, chopping here up and down we have the rsi right at the 15 the one hour stochastic is also coming up and down bollinger band macd as well we should maybe go to the bigger time frames also here the four hour you see that um, we're still trading at the 50 level uh, if we go over to the bollinger band also here we're squeezing into the bollinger band right here in the middle macd is also flat here so in the short time frames i don't see anything which could indicate where we're going next but here in the bigger time frames if we open up the daily you can see that actually it is very bullish because we're trading above the 15 rsi all the stochastic is coming from the, from oversold territory but we have all the moving averages below of us so the 20 daily is here at 9150 and the 50 and the 200 are at eight thousand dollar so i think it is very likely that if we're gonna have a breakout to the downside we first going to meet here and test the 20 daily at 9170 and if this one is also gonna fail we maybe go down to retest the 250 at eight thousand dollar and if those moving averages are not holding then prepare to retrace completely back down here towards the 0 0.618 fib line here at 6230 and this is also where i'm setting in my entries uh, to buy some cheap bitcoins here at around six thousand two hundred thirty dollars so as you can see the 50 and 200 daily moving average are crossing today so today we're gonna have this golden cross and as i told you also in the past always when this happens we always had big moves not always to the bullish side like we should expect but sometimes also to the bearish side so of course we could have now a breakout because of that but it's not clear to which direction and that's why also i'm not trading this on a bullish way i'm just waiting for the breakout here for, to the downside or to the upside and if we go over to the Bollinger Band also here you can see that the MACD is flat and we're trading still at the upper area here so we could even retrace back down here to the midline of around nine thousand dollar even down to eight thousand five hundred would be still bullish that wouldn't mean that we will completely start a new bear market in the opposite we just would have here a correction from this move that we had here after this run up to ten thousand maybe bounce somewhere between six thousand to eight thousand dollar and then start the real 
breakout here of this $10,000. It is possible, but of course we could also start it from this breakout right now. So let's have also a final look on the weekly time frame because here also we have now several weeks in green here. Stochastic is coming in overbought territory, so that could be an, an indication that we could top out here at least for the short time frame here that we could maybe have one or two weeks here of a little correction down to one of these uh, fib lines and then have the big start of the bull run so even if we retrace back down here and we don't bring the rsi back below the 50 this still would be very bullish and we should bounce from this level and then have the begin of the real bull run but here based on the rsi we would still have a lot of room left to the upside that we could even break here this ten thousand five hundred dollar resistance so it's really depending how we're gonna break out from this pattern that we are in right now and even if we drop down here you see that the 50 and 20 weekly moving average are below of us so even if we go again towards 8,000 even down here to the 200 weekly moving average at around six thousand dollar this would be still very bullish for the long term so important is that we're not gonna lose these supports down here at around 6k so with that said guys we're gonna wrap it up for now remember that if you want to trade these pumps and dumps you can do that over on Bybit, Femex, Bityard or Primex BT because there you can trade with the leverage so that means that you can trade with smaller amounts use a leverage up to 100x and you can gain a lot of money with small amounts so make sure if you need still a trading account to use my invitation links that you find down below here in the video description because with my links you can get some sign up bonus and also some rewards so make sure to use my links and also if you have Coinbase you can still claim some free altcoins here worth of $10 so go down and check those links out if you have coinbase i have still some slots free here so go and use them as long as they are valid so thank you very much for watching guys don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel we do daily ta videos and also you can participate to the bitcoin giveaway that we do with every 500 subscribers so thank you very much for watching guys and we see us all in the next one bye